Rob Welcome has a back. special package for you. Episode number 48. And we're very excited because we have a box here. A little product review. The what does it say? What does it say? It says, open your mind. Now, so is that telling you to rip open your skull? No. This is <laughs> okay. a... However, I can understand the inclination. This is a company on Instagram and they make stash boxes. Company on Instagram. No, okay. That's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> so this is a company and they make stash boxes, high-end stash boxes, and they've been kind enough to send us one as they've just launched their new product and their new colorway. Yes. So we're going to open it up and we're going to show you. First of all, first of all, now, nah, before oh. you open it up, bro, peep the box, bro. Yeah. The yeah. box has some fire details No, the box it. is nice. The box is nice. It has like an elegant, like an no. elegant, um, yeah. fucking, what's it called? Square format on the side. Design. It has the Instagram on the, Instagram labels yeah. on the side. And I like their logo as well. Their logo is actually right. dripping. But now like let's get on to the, the real stuff here. Because as you open the box, let me see if I can do this a little bit like this, right? You open the box, you open the, the box. And once the box has been opened, right, you see, let me put that down carefully. You see, first of all, a little thank you card. Thank you. Open your mind. Right? Yeah, facts. And inside you see this beautiful, beautiful red, right? Genuinely so Genuinely, drippy. It's so drippy. It's, and it's so like, drippy. It has like a glossy finish yeah, yeah, on yeah, it, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The box slides down, right? You can take out the box, right? <laughs> We carefully do that. Put that down carefully. We opened this yesterday. We'll show you our reactions. They will already be on the Instagram, but damn, this product's fire. We had to open it just to see a look. We haven't rolled with it yet, but yeah. So as you can see right inside, a beautiful box, right? With their logo on it. You undo the golden clasp. You open it and uh, inside, you might, you might be thinking, what am I looking at here, right? Fast. You have three jars to store your weed in. Your different strains, right? Don't grab the other I'm one. I'm not going to. kind of loose. <laughs> and then you have a rolling tray built in that is removable, right? And this rolling tray. I'm going to need that rolling tray, by the it way. It has a space. Oh, you're going to get the whole box. Ooh. It has a space for you to put the pape, right? And a little space for you to collect your ganja. And on the inside, you can store all your papes and everything you need. This genuinely. That's such a. This like, is something the that. Best weed product I've ever seen. Uh, yeah, yeah. And like not Hands even. Down. Not even weed product that I have. Weed product that I've ever seen, bro. Exactly. And like it's gen. Like it's such a high quality product, bro. Like the open your mind is like engraved. Like I don't even care about the podcast. I just want to just like look at this, bro. No, no. It genuinely. Like, and on the on the inside, when you open it on the on the the top, it it has like a nice engraved like open your exactly. mind thing, and it just looks. But even just so look cool. at the attention to detail, bro. The little like like the little gold hinges here, right? I don't know if you can see that. But like, it's just a really nice, high quality product. So thank you guys very much. Open your mind. Genuinely. This Genuinely. is something that we will use very often. Bro. It will be like very next often. set. Bear in mind, season two is coming. Next this will be on the set. It's going the to time. be yeah. a complete yeah. different set, more minimalistic. Yeah. But this is something worth adding yeah, on the set. For sure. And I say we open it. Like we have it open the way you're looking oh, at it right sure. now. For sure. And so there you go. There's you. the rolling tray. We'll, and I'll the pass good that thing about you. this rolling tray is that it has literally the perfect like pape holder exactly for you to roll in no more having to like keep your pape balanced inside the pape packet loosely no bro if Here you're, you if go. you're one of them rollers there's, there's a lot pape. of people that you don't even and put it on you their don't hand. even need this anymore get that shit over there bro you don't even need that anymore bro. oh you don't even need that anymore but generally but you do need it because it has more pape and it even has like little grippy stuff at the bottom just to like stay oh, damn. So just this attention is, to detail it's so really this, like this is a high quality product and if you guys want to pick one of these up Head over to their Instagram. The link will be in the description. And Facts. check it out. Go support them because they supported us. And Open your mind. We really like them. No, for real, thank you so much. Because we've been talking to them for a long time. And yeah, they've just released a new product. And they were like, bro, let's send it to you. We want, we want to see you guys' this reaction. This is a company I'd want to work with, genuinely. Exactly. Exactly. Genuinely. So thank you guys very much. And like, we really appreciate you. Because this is fucking fire, bro. Like, Facts. this is so fucking cool, bro. Like, this is dope. I will, can you hold my laptop real quick for a second so I can like put this on the table here? For a second. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So... All right, while you get to rolling, I wanted to come at you with a start bank sell real quick, Nicholas. Real Bro, quick. I was so close to coming mm, with this. Mm. And Is this football player edition? No, high foods edition, right? Oh, okay, so, okay, 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 right, I'm ready. Start bank sell, right? I'm going to overthink every single one. I want you to know. I'm going to come at you right. The first one, cereal. Well, but, but. You need to give me. You need to give me three options. I know. I, I know. Tell you I just want to gauge your reaction to it. Cereal. Okay, but okay. There's crazy variations, but I'm. A, yeah, it's on. It's on. Oh Jesus! Thank fuck, bro. Because I saw like the zeros. I was like, no. All right. Yeah. Cereal. Cereal. The second one. Several variations. I like cocoa mm. pops. So we... it's nice to see the stuff flowing around. Makes me feel like I'm a pirate, right? Second one. Good noodles or any form of ramen noodles, instant noodles, 
You know what I mean? Ooh. That one drops down on the list, I can't lie. And third one, a tuna cheese toasty. <laughs> <laughs> Did we take any videos of the ones we made? No, we're going to make some later, oh, so it's all right. My, oh, <laughs> let me tell you. I think I already know what your number one is. My number one. Or who are you starting? Okay, start. Yeah, yeah what? It's not number one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me just say, the other week, um, I made myself a tuna toasty sandwich, right? Can I just pause you for a second, bro? For all the audio listeners and also the, the YouTube listeners that can't see it, there is an absolute mountain of weed, of weed in front of me, bro. Uh, yeah, yeah. Are sorry. you not excited? Oh, I am. I am. But just continue, continue. I'm going to the library after see? this. That's my plan. Ooh, no, you're not. I am. I am. I am. Trust. Okay, we'll see about that one. But we made some tuna melt sandwiches. Let's just put it like that. Yeah, tuna a, melt sandwich. a tuna melt. Let's make it sound American. You feel make me? it like, a little make bit it professional. Sound better. That shit was bussin'. Mm. That was fucking bussin'. Mm. However. Cereal is a mainstay and it's easier to make while high. So you got to take the simplicity into account. Ooh. First of all, let me just quickly, very quickly sell the noodles. Yeah, yeah. Get yeah. out. And it's not Get that out. they're bad, but it's just like... Mm, You're high, mm. so the only noodles you can make is good noodles. You're really not trying to eat that because it, it ain't as good it's as only the like, other options. Exactly, exactly. It's your last option. It's your last option. Yes. Right, and so therefore, I am selling it. Now... Start and bench. See, the thing is, the thing is, the thing is, think about it. Tuna melt is a crazy impact sub. It's mm. a crazy impact sub. Whereas Cocoa Pops is a mainstay. You understand? Like That's Cocoa true. Pops is somebody you'd want to start week in, week out. However, Do you know what the, the tuna melt is like a trossard, you know? It comes off the in, bench. Let me picture in there real quick. Another first. thing with the cereal is like, look, if we eat, if you eat one tuna melt, right? you're going to want another one. You have to make the bread again, put the tuna, put the cheese, wait for it to cook, right? When the cereal is done, you still have milk in the bowl. You just add a little bit more. You know what I mean? Exactly. You just add a little bit more. Exactly. So I understand what you're saying here. And I genuinely thought that you were going to go tuna melt guaranteed number one. So I'm excited to see who are you, I'm, who are you bro, starting. I'm like, the more I think about it, the more I'm in between because it, there's not nah, tuna melt, tuna melt, tuna melt, tuna melt. But you need to put the correct sauce with it. And I'm telling you, it's only ketchup. Can't think of a single sauce that mm, would go better. That's true. That's true. I'm sorry. Anyone that says barbecue, first of all, you're American and Facts. get the fuck out, right? Second of all, if you say mayo, I understand it, but like, come no, on, man, have some bro. Tuna and mayo goes. That's so true. That's together. true. That's a good combo. But I don't like tuna. I don't like mayo and bread, bro. But the best part about the tuna melt is that the oil from the tuna goes through, and you can see the oil through. The no, bread, no, but bro. you made one tuna melt the other day, and it was like. Because you already said like, oh, I don't put that much tuna on them. And then I look at your, and I look at your toasty and it's like dripping in sauce, bro. Fire, so fire. Also, shout out to the... Oh, is that the only start bench sell? Yeah, yeah that's the only one. That, okay, that, well, that was just one. let me just clarify because I don't think we clarified. Start bench sell, tuna melt sub, um, noodles and Cocoa Pops. Sell noodles for sure. Surely start with start. Start Cocoa Pops bench Tuna melt. I don't think. I'm sorry. I don't have an issue with that. I'm I don't have sorry. an issue with that. You don't need to apologize. What you should be flexing, though, is that Chinese shirt that you got on, my friend. Facts. Can you name Wait, any Chinese Are noodles Chinese or are noodles Japanese? I'm just going to say. <laughs> but noodles cannot. There's also German noodles, bro. Every country has their own form of noodle, bro. German noodles. It's facts, bro. Every country has their own form of noodles, bro. You know what German noodles are? You know what Germans do? What do they do? You know what Germans do? What do they do? Germans. They oh, it pops over, right back into place. Right back into place. Yeah, but I don't know if that's on shot, but yeah. Um, the thing is with yeah, kiss it, bro. Kiss Give it a little kiss. You bro. might as well start making out with it. I don't want to ruin the product. Get my saliva all over it. Bro. But yeah, so talk about the noodles then. German people will eat their like their good noodles without even having cooked them. Like they'll eat them as if it was a cracker. I swear on my life, that's a thing. In year seven, bro. Oh, Rahul. We used to do that, bro. Shake up the packet, bang it on the table a couple of times. Because where are you going to get hot water from at school, bro? Like, you could get it very yeah, easily for free. Why are you bringing noodles to school? Bro, like, I don't know. It's I, no, it's also fun no, to, to be like, fair, I used to even yeah. bring noodles to school. But they were brought in some, like... In the thermos. Thermo container. Those always, bro, whenever someone opens those at the lunch table, you can smell it from a mile away, bro. And it but always smells blessing. so good. Yeah, it smells blessing. so good. Unless but it's I, an Indian. I always, bro, as a child, bro, I swear my life, I hated... 
I absolutely despise bringing food to school. Bro, really? I hated it. That's the thing. As a kid, I hated doing that as well, but I also hated the school food. So at lunch, I just wouldn't eat and I'd just go play, bro. 90 minutes, I full know. 90 football, yeah. bro. Like, come on, bro. <laughs> no, no, no. Of course, bro. If you're a real G, like what real Gs would do is take their lunch with them outside to play football and eat while you're playing. No, but Have I can't do that, Have your Tupperware on the side and grab the next sandwich when the goal is scored. Trust me. Crazy, bro. Trust crazy. Me. I never even like thought of OG, it like that. Dude. I never that's, even thought of it like, like that. That's like the like peak. Fair, fair, fair. Damn. Well, but you me... never really participated in the year 10 versus year 11 mm -mm. football matches. I, I played more football like, bro, like year 7, 8, 9, and especially in Indonesia, bro, because we'd play on the football pitch that like you'd play football on like on Saturdays, right? Like as like a team, right? Like AstroTurf. No, definitely not AstroTurf. Like it's like normal <laughs> grass. But like, bro, generally... Highlight of my footballing career, bro. What? Just like... Break times. No, no, no. Like, playing football in Indonesia. Just like, the orange slices that, like, some... Because yeah. it's like... It's Those a, are unmatched. It's a Jakarta international school, right? But everyone's basically American there, bro. Yeah, like, it's grades. It's not years. You know what I mean? You're in first grade, second grade. So, at lunch... Or not lunch. On Saturday football games, bro. Halftime. It's like fucking like 28 degrees, boiling hot sun. Ugh, bro. These moms... These MILFs bring in their, like, little orange slices, bro. Oh, yes, please, bro. Pre, like, peeled. Oh, yeah. Lovely, bro. The thing bro. is, like, it doesn't fill you up that much. But once you consume mm -hmm. your five orange slices, you're yeah. on for another half. You're ready to go. You're ready to go. You're ready to continue. Also, let me, before you spark the Zwen, or while you spark the Zwen, I wanted to get into the weed news. Because there's actually something pretty crazy that I saw that happened this week. Okay. So, I don't know if you've heard, but a Premier League player was found with a huge cannabis farm in a house that he owns a premier league a player. premier league player now the player is unnamed but it, it's in the northwest of sure, england are you sure are you sure it's a it's a cannabis house yes so let me explain to you what the thing is right so he hasn't been charged but it's he owns the house and he delegated the house to a family member right he gave the house to one of his yeah, family fair. members and that family member can i guess who it is it doesn't oh, wait, say it doesn't say who it is but so that family member they got in ties with the wrong types of people and they basically turned that person's house into a trap house where they grow weed. I'm not sure if that's the exact picture, but like basically, so the police raided the house and yeah. the like the football player and the family member that they gave the house to basically had to like testify in court and prove, prove that they like had no idea that any of this was going on. Can I whip out my can I whip out my honorable mentions for who I think it is now? Yeah, of course. It's in the northwest of England, by the way. Northwest. Yeah. Okay, see that does narrow it down. See, I had three players in mind. Mm. I had Leon Bailey in mind. Jamaican. Mm. I had Mikel Antonio in mind. Jamaican links as well. However, Leon Bailey, Birmingham. That's East, I'm pretty sure. I'm 90% sure it's East. Yeah. West Ham and Michael Antonio, London. Mm -hmm. However, Raza Gaza Raheem Sterling no. is, has a lot of Jamaican roots. You can imagine that family ties, right, would link him to the Ganja roots. Okay, let me tell you this, right? And Northwest is just Manchester. That's true. But what about, right, you're talking about Manchester. Ooh. Listen, Anthony's been playing shit recently, right? He's been playing <laughs> shit, yeah, 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 okay. right? He's been spending too much time with all these little... He's like, you know what, bro? I'm not getting game time. Let me go back to what I know. Favela ball. And I'm not talking football. Uh -huh. I'm talking slinging that. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's You're what Anthony started to do. That's what I think it is, bro. That's what I think it is. So who are our honorable mentions for who's growing the weed farm in their oath? What? Who are our mentions, bro? Oh, Surely we I'm shout out some football players that we think it is. I think... Hands down, Anthony, bro. Has to be Manchester players it or maybe to. Liverpool players. It, I Ooh, could even see... Luis Diaz because his dad got kidnapped. <gasps> but would he... Mm, genuinely, Delegated his that is house a crazy. to his dad. His dad got kidnapped. Bro. But to escape the, the kidnapping, he gave them a house and now they're growing weed in it. Crazy conspiracy theory. Do you believe in any conspiracy theories? I love conspiracy theories. What are some that you... I don't know if I believe in them, but... But, like, what are some that you like to indulge in? Like, what's a conspiracy theory that you want to share to the fans? That's just like... General, the fans general ones, ones. General yeah. ones. General yeah, ones. Yeah, not, like, any crazy ones. Aliens, right? Mm. I believe, but I don't think that's a I conspiracy believe... theory, bro. I think okay, aliens, okay, that's just human okay. nature. I'm talking more the like... Meg still being alive. 
And that's not a conspiracy theory I believe in. That's just a fear I hold within <coughs> myself till the day I die. But why do you, but you, do you, it, a part of you thinks that a, there could still be a Megalodon swimming around. That's what you're saying. A part of me believes, no, I believe there is still a Meg swimming Fully. around. Yeah. You think, you think those big, yeah. uh, really? Have you watched the movie of the Meg? Yes, but that's not what you should be basing it off. Under I know, some I know. ice thing, right? Yes, yeah, like the Where different layers in the ocean. Through, yeah. I still, like, first of all, we haven't even explored most of the, like, mm. we haven't, we, we're nowhere close to finishing exploring the ocean. I haven't, I couldn't fact check it right now because my laptop is closed and I'm not about to open it right now. But we've only explored like a low percentage of the actual ocean. We've explored ocean. like more of space than we have the ocean, bro. Okay, yeah. well, that's awesome. That's that's, that's, that one's a crazy statement. That's but like, we've only explored like 6% of the ocean, bro. Relax, relax, calm down, calm down. I can't, I can't believe calm I agree down. with you for half a second, bro. <laughs> calm down. It yeah. sounds it sound like it made sense. No, but we've only explored like 6% of the ocean. Six percent, and I don't need to fact check because I know I'm right. I'm gonna say six percent. I, back it. Let, let me I back it. I back it. Like maybe even eight, bro. What percent of the ocean has been five percent? Oh come on! Wow, what a guess! No, come genuinely. On. And now let's left see. Hand, left hand. Let's see how much of space has been explored. Five percent? No, that's just not true because we don't know how fucking big space is, bro. Okay, <laughs> look, bro. Google, like, Google, you can't you can't fucking yeah, yeah i know, I know, I know. <laughs> yeah but no but like genuinely i do believe that maybe it's not a meg maybe it's not a meg. listen but there is one animal that will terrorize the sea mm. there's yeah. one living under there for sure but the only issue with that is that it, when you go down to those depths where there's no light and you have all those like those weird looking fish you know what i mean like the blob fish and like the fish with the light on its head right those are all like those animals they weigh nothing and they're so small because there's such little food down there a meg is not surviving down there. But who says there's such unless there's another down. layer below that? You know what I mean, like everything, everything like adapts to its own environments, bro. But there's, you there's realize a lot of food living there for mm -hmm. sure, bro. One day it will be explored, bro. Ocean Gate. Facts. Yeah. We Facts. all know what happened with Ocean Gate. Would you go on? It's terror, it's well, speaking of, place. would you ever go on like a thing like that, like a submarine going all the way down? No, 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 not no. going all the way down. But how, like, how far down would you go? As far as I can dive. Yeah, fair. that's as far. And as you I can dive quite far. How far can no, you dive? No, no, no. Like as, as far like as depth. I'd be willing to dive, but not as far as I'm what's licensed. The, what's, to dive. what's the depth that you're licensed to dive? Like twenty meters, like twenty five meters. I don't like ocean wise. You have to realize I've only ever been on the surface of the ocean. Like I can't gauge twenty five meters in you water you depth. Can't, you can't. Like you I can't, can't perceive, perceive how deep that is. You know what I mean? Like, remember, it's so remember deep. where when we were swimming in the ocean, right? And you're like, I'm not fucking going any further. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then I'd try and see, like, I'd well you, try and see how like deep yeah because you open is. your eyes in the ocean that's yeah, also that's also bro, crazy that's bro. a normal thing bro bro genuinely like genuinely in bali it did hurt a little bit more bro mm. but the, the water there is weird bro like depending on where you are the water there's fucking weird but in spain bro in the in the mediterranean i'll open my eyes all the time but like we we're in greece and we were swimming at a certain point and genuinely rahul's like i'm not swimming no, any no. further i'm a big it, but like it was max <laughs> max max two meters depth max no but it's it's not. It, it's, the, I don't. To the bottom. It's not about how deep it is. It's about how far away from the land I am, bro. No, no, that's no, my I issue. Know, I know. But, I mean. Oh, how far away? I don't know. It's not about the okay. depth. It's but more about for, for but diving. Like, it's all about depth. But it's how? Far, so you can dive twenty-five meters. How far would you be willing to dive? Fifty. Mm. Fifty's fucking far. Like fifty is like dark. Fifty is dark. You'd want to go down there? I don't know, bro. I don't know. I'm taking because imagine it's I haven't all, seen it either, bro. It's all dark. You turn around and there's just like. But this like thing at, with at like twenty-five fangs, bro. meters, you can see fucking like a shit ton of shipwrecks. Wait, is there still imagine what you can see yeah. at like no at like fifteen? You can see shipwrecks. Really? Imagine Damn. what you can see at fucking like imagine what you can see at fifty meters, bro. But mm. imagine the crazy shit you'd see as well. You know what I was wondering, bro? Mm. Just to like go off on something about boats, right? When there's like these like big like yachts and stuff, right? And like or these cruise ships, right? And people are like taking shits on these cruise ships. Does it go into a tank? Like it does in airplanes, or do they just dump it out? They dump it out for into sure. the ocean. They dump it out. Surely you sure. just dump it out into the ocean for sure. Okay, good. For sure. I say because if because sure. trains also Plus, just dump it it's out. It's like, bro, uh, yeah, like our shit. That. Our shit has a lot of like nutrients, bro. Like, yeah, our shit is that's good true. Like for it, is actually, know, it is actually it is actually good for the ocean. If you shit in the sea, you will spot like fish coming towards it to eat your. Have shit. you seen? There's like a. I've seen my shit. Okay, no, there's like a TikTok of some guy and he was in some like, on like the bottom of the ocean doing some like research thing, right? And like to shit, you have to like, because they build like an air pocket, right? And you have to go out of the air pocket and go to like the little bathroom 
and which is in a different air yeah pocket. you've seen the thing right yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, but to and mention then, it mentioned, yeah, and it then mentioned. and then so he gets to the air pocket so he gets to like the little bathroom air pocket middle of the night complete dark and yeah. like he just starts shitting and then but when he no because there, there's a small light at the thing right because you know where to swim to you, sh- you you swim there right like you go into like the little air pocket right and then you pull down your pants and you take a shit right and like fish they know that like overnight like they realize like oh Whenever someone goes out here, there's some food. So he does his business, pulls up his pants, goes back down, and he just sees like an eye that's like the size of his head, just like staring at him. And he didn't know what the fuck it was. Was it that? Or was it just a shit ton of No, 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 no. It was a big ass eye. And what it is, is I think it's called like, I don't know what it is. It's either called like, I want to say a whopper, but it's not a whopper. It's like a- A whopper is a burger. Yeah, exactly. I scammed from doing a survey. In Facts, bro. They violated the survey because I felt bad, bro. Because I told you to do the fucking I'm so, survey, bro. I'm fucking yeah. I'm nah, it's it's fine. Yeah, I I Stupid I can't I can't find the name of the fish, bro. But I I like that. I think that's a nice little, you know, like I don't know, bro. The ocean's so weird, bro. It's just like it's a whole different world, bro. But we all came from the ocean. You know what I mean? Like, Facts. Facts. Like, what do you think possessed the first ocean being animal to be like, bro? Let me go up on that on that rock, bro. Like fuck all this, bro. Like imagine the first guy. Yeah, all the, all of his other fish buddies are like, bro. What I is even this guy to doing? To answer bro? that question, because regardless, what I'm gonna say is dumb as dirt, bro. But imagine, like, if we were all fish, and one day you go, "Hey, bro, I'm gonna go over there on that on that land." We're like, bro, like, let me are you suicidal? Right? Like, yeah. like, bro, like, don't say that type of shit, bro. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, bro, like, like we care about you. Like, what are you doing? That <laughs> are that's you what it would be exactly. But that was the answer, bro. First, yeah, first person to go to Mars, bro. Imagine, imagine we never knew, and Mars just fucking like, like had Mars some magnetic bro. pull that, like, if a human goes there, bam, we're dead. Bro. I saw this YouTube video, and it was talking about. Well, I saw the thumbnail. I didn't end up clicking on it, but I should have. And it was talking about ten planets that are more habitable than Earth, bro. And if it's like, if it's more habitable than Earth, there has to be life there, surely. Like, surely that's how that works. Yeah, but we're designed. It's habitable for humans, bro. That's true. That's very thing, true. Bro. That's very true. You know, that's very true. It's not habitable for life. That's uh, very okay, true. Okay, let's go on to our fucking top five yeah. because I'm slowly losing touch with reality. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No. No. We've been on a very high topic, bro. bro I, we are doing a draft this week, right? We are building. A we're not f- doing a draft. Football five aside. Yes, we are. Oh, you can't pick any the, the the other person's player. I mean, I doubt we have the same player. Yeah, but I feel but like I, I feel like we came. Like, I, have a I would like to. I think we should picture as more of a an XI, right? We came with a XI. Okay. So imagine, right? It is a, you could say, you know, like a FIFA Street game. That's the yes. best way I can put FIFA it. FIFA uh, Volta. Yeah, FIFA Volta, FIFA Street. Yeah. Right. One goalkeeper, four outfield players, any formation you want. Right. Yeah. Yeah. One goalkeeper, four outfield. Yeah. So outfield. what? Um, no, you give me your you give me your team first. But, no, no, but what formation, formation? What formation did you go for? Like, I went describe for your formation. I bro, because I have I mine just, written out on Snapchat. I'm yet to design my team, bro. Like, okay. I don't know who to, like, I brought, I don't know, like, because I know that there's okay. players that you're going to be like, that's illegal to put them on. Okay. Well, I feel like. Well, let me, do you want me to just say my entire team? You don't want to go position no, for, I, I for mean, position. No, no, entire team, and then I'll go my entire team. We've never done it like that, okay. so let's do it. Okay, so I'm playing a, including the goalkeeper, no, it's formation is excluding goalkeeper, surely, like four or five aside. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm playing a 2-1-1, right? Yeah. So I have two defenders. A two one one and a striker. Yeah. Two one one's pretty crazy though. A two one one, but you have to realize my defenders are not like defenders. Like I'm like my entire team, including my goalkeeper. No, they're not wingers, but they're the only people at the back. But I'm not trying to do no defending. You know what I mean? In that sense, every. Oh, so you're sitting. Back. No, no. Every player can defend. No, I'm attacking. Every player can defend, but yeah. every player can also run up the yeah. wing. You know what I mean? Yeah. In that sense, so in goal, right? I have Jake from Adventure Time. Oh, you motherfucker. <laughs> Yeah, thank you very See, much. This is why. It's, fuck. Thank you very much. Thank fuck. you very much. His name is Finn, by the way. No, Finn's the guy, bro. I have the dog. Oh, the dog. Yes, the dog is the one with the long arms. Motherfucker. Exactly. Exactly. I was tripping Don't so worry, much. Man. I was. Did you have him as well? Yes, bro. But you had Jake on your list. N- I had Finn. I had Finn. Okay, yeah, yeah, Finn. Down. Oh fuck, bro. I should have done it because you would have said Finn, Finn was the one with the long arms. No, 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 that's yeah, why yeah, I didn't yeah. put him on my list. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. Bro, look, I'll show you my list in a second. Not yet, not yet, not yet. No, okay, course. well, I'm very happy that I um, got that. So let me now get on to my left back, right? My left back is Stitch from Lilo and Stitch. Oh! And I'm not taking, and I'm not taking the That's normal. That's the blue one, right? Yeah, I'm not taking the normal mm. version. 
Mm. I'm taking the four-armed version. Oh, you're taking the upgraded version. I'm taking, taking the evolution. And obviously, at the start of the game, he starts off normal. But like, if one of your players is getting, I mouthy, didn't know we could. I didn't know we could use overpowered fucking animals. Not overpowered. You use the person and not can all I, of their abilities. Can I include a Pokemon? Is that allowed? Yeah, but you can't. Yeah, but if you include Charizard, it's not like he can fucking like breathe fire on people. That's not no, what no, happens. No, 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 My yeah, striker's I mean, already determined. Like, right. there's no, there's no right. beating who my oh, who my top striker is. Trust, right? trust. Like, you can't beat this. All right, guy. so my left back is Stitch, right? Fuck. My right back is Heat Blast from Ben Ten. Now I don't know. This is generally oh, this guy. Okay, he is crazy. he is the because I wanted to take That's Ben crazy. Ten. I wanted to put Ben Ten at ten, right? Brother. But this guy is literally the coldest. Fucking like Ben 10 character you, of all time. How many times have you watched the first Ben 10 movie? Bro, oh, I've, I didn't watch the movie. I just watched the show, bro. Oh, I've, that scene, I've only seen the TV show, bro. Oh, no, no. Movie? Yeah, but this scene is the from the show, bro. This scene is from like the show, bro. Times. This is the first episode of the show. When, that's, that's in the movie. When that's he the turns into movie. the when he turns into the fire. Is that the movie? I swear it's yeah, the show, bro. Movie. Oh, well, then that's what I watched, bro. The movie is where he finds this is, the This is the first day when he gets his watch and then he burns everything. Yeah. Yeah. That's a movie, bro. Damn, I it's thought that that was the first movie. episode. I've watched but, a million times. But did you times watch the show as well? Where he beats the fucking, like, I don't know, it comes in an asteroid and mm. then he finds it. Yeah, while someone is chasing it and yeah. it's like, bro, generally so far. His but yeah, sister so, didn't have superpowers yet. Yeah, that is my right back, right? And you're thinking, right back? Who who the fuck did you have up top if that's your right back, right? That's your left back, right back combo? Wow, right? I have Leonardo from Dream Kicks, right? And people follow me here right let me give you an introduction i don't know who leonardo let me give you an introduction and then i'll show them to you right dream kicks was a show made in south korea to promote the 2010 world cup right and it was it always featured on fucking indonesian tv always for at least like two years every single day after school i'd watch that and then some other like fucking like other show because and then cartoon network and stuff would come on you know what i mean but like on early days you could watch that right and it was a show about each team was made up of different animals right and leonardo was on basically i'd say like the best team in the you league show and he was that guy yes. boom bro leonardo bro this man bro read the description read it bro he's the best brightest most famous football player in today's game he's savage united's top striker and he's known all over the world by almost anyone bro bro he's that guy right i like your shout he's that i'm guy. not trying to discredit your shouts but mine is better Mine That's fine. Better. That's fine. That's fine. Mine but is better. That, yeah. And then up top, I have kicked Patowski. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why I've kicked brother, Patowski up top. Brother. Brother. Bro. I, have, I have a pool of eight players, right? Yeah. You used three of them. Bro. Kick you Patowski three of them, up top because I was going to go Sandy. You would not have used him if I haven't fucking spoken about him in the past fucking I literally would have because I was, no, I, I was doing research. I was doing research. I, I, it's no, not like you I, would not. I saw him on Google and it reminded me of him. It's not like I thought of it. I saw it on Google and it reminded bro, me. I thought of him with, like, he was one of the first yeah. names to come up in my head. Because up top, the helmet, bro, bow. Ah, mid. Yeah, I mean, listen. You yeah, have on your list. Man, stand, yeah, but. I Wait, would, but you don't even have a team. You guys have names. Yes, I, bro, because yeah. I didn't okay. know which players would be legal or not. That's right. Well, let me give you a rundown of Since my we're list. allowed to use Pokemon, that's yeah, a yeah. different story, bro. You're allowed, allowed to use we one Pokemon. You're allowed to use one Pokemon. Because we said one per show. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, let me give you let me give you a recap of my list, right? In goal, we have Jake from Adventure Goku, Time. Bro, like, right. You can't be doing that. We got Jake from Adventure Time. Left back, we got Stitch. Right back, Heat Blast from Ben 10. At number 10, we got Leonardo from Dream Kicks. And then above him, we got Kick Patowski. That's my 2 1 1 from Genuinely, Mitchell. I have a very close shout to your. Um, what was it from Neon and Kick or something like that? Oh, oh from Dream Kicks, Leonardo. No, 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 no. The oh, Lilo and Stitch. Lilo and Stitch, bro. Yeah, Stitch, Stitch, Stitch. I have a very similar That show so that. fire, bro. That show so fire. So good, bro. Highly recommend, bro. Even as a scuffed show, I haven't watched it as a okay. high show, but I would think it would be good. Are you ready for mine? I, I've I'm already ready. designed my team. What's your formation? Oh, bro. What's up? You used my goalkeeper, bro, but you didn't use my but goalkeeper. I didn't use your goalkeeper. I should have. position. Wait. It, like, mm. My goalkeeper is your right back, bro. Ben 10, bro. Mm. Oh, let me first tell you which formation I'm playing. Let me first tell you which formation yeah, yeah, I'm sorry playing. That. I'm playing a fucking one, two, one. I like one that. defender. A little diamond. A little diamond. Two midfielders. I like that. A little diamond. And one star striker. My captain of the team. So in goal, who do you have? In goal, I have Ben 10. Like Ben. Like just Ben 10. Ben Tangerman. Because that's his name. 
That is his name. His last name is Tangerman. I'm telling you, it's facts. You want me to search it up? You want me to search it up? You want me to search it up? Ben Ten full name. Ben oh Benjamin Tennyson. Kirby. Tennyson. Ben Tennyson. Yeah. What did I yeah. say? Tangerman. Oh, that's close, bro. That's close. Bro. Ben Tangerman, you said. Yeah, that Loki, that's better than Tennyson, bro. Oh my days. You're dumb as dirt. How am I dumb, bro? How? You're dumb as dirt. You said Ben Tangerman when it's B- Benjamin Tenneman. It's Tennyson, first. Tennyson, of all. fucking way. Okay, regardless, regardless. Yeah, it's fire. Yes, no? bro. It looks it's fucking cool, yeah. creepy. It's cold, bro. Um, okay, so. Do you want this to be on the podcast? That's but, up to you. You say your idea, I bro. I have a brilliant idea, okay? Wait, wait. wait. <laughs> it's going to come out weird, okay? It's going to sound weird. But, bro, what if I slide Chimis from 90 Minute Podcast and we have, like, a fucking an intro of our podcast, like, a tune, like, subscribe to 90 Minute Podcast, like a baddie doing that. Oh, that's so cool. I can't lie. That's cool as fuck. That's cool as fuck. Bro, you said it was going to come out wrong. That's the best idea, bro. That's the best but idea You should ever, just bro. open with, hey, can you make a video for us? Yeah, no, don't try to slide him. Don't try to slide. Nah, nah, don't no, try to no, slide. Because you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna be putting, you're gonna be putting your game. No, but you're gonna be putting your game via the podcast account. You can't do that, bro. That's that's the issue. <laughs> no, because you that's can't so slide fire. from a business account, hey, bro. I back it, bro. Why not? <laughs> but don't slide fully. Don't like, bro, don't like be bro, like, bro. hey, what you doing? Type shit. Just be like. <laughs> Like, because I know that's a very. But how message. are you gonna slide from a just podcast like, account? What, what, like, what would be the opening line, bro? No, no, no. just to get them to do the video. <laughs> just be like, okay, like, hey, can you Loki, like, like, can you Loki bless us up? Yeah, yeah, fact. We'll fool them into thinking no, they have zero point five percent equity in our company. Yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> no, but because I saw that you. You, well, I don't know, you followed some baddie on the account. Did I? I? Just not, I just posted something on the account. I, I looked up at the stories and one of the profiles, like, oh, that's a baddie. Like, <laughs> oh, follow okay. here. And then I got the idea. I was like, what if, right? Yeah, I'm going to do that. Yeah, fire. Fire. Hey, but you got to find I a really one, hope man. that was all picked up on audio. I oh, really hey, hope can you check the cameras on? Hey, tell me, bro. We're going to use this box all the time, bro. Look how fire. Tell me, bro, you, don't, you never need to use a paper bro, anymore. You can just put the paper in bro, here, bro. Look at this, bro. They got jars, bro. And you can take out the rolling tray and store shit in there, bro. And you can roll on this bro, fucking you're, you're thing using with the tape. Two times max. Yeah, but it's going to be open in the room the entire time, bro. bro. It's going to be so fire, bro. It looks... Bro. Like, even if you even don't if, use it bro, all even the time, if we don't use it, then, then we can't display, ruin it, bro. It just has to be here, bro. It's so cool, bro. engraving, bro. Drippy. Cold. All right. Dope. Enjoy. I right, enjoy so this sliding is an through for the podcast. To spend the account. entire day just sliding women, bro. Oh my day. <laughs> no. Hey, but if it works, you gotta play <laughs> them. Hey, this is my personal, you by know, the way. You know, fires. You know, fair. I close the door, bro. Close the fucking door, bro. I guess. That's we a great idea. We hope you enjoyed that little. That's a great idea. So, in goal, who do you have? Okay, okay, okay. I said one, two, one. Yeah, as yeah. my formation. You're, you're playing a little diamond. In goal, I had Ben Ten. Yes. Yes. At center back, have you watched Futurama before? I have, but I, it wasn't in the constant Bender. I'm going to need a picture. Let me, let me get myself Bender. a picture. I have never seen anyone being able to drink as many beers as this motherfucking robot, right? Oh, the robot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fire, Bro, fire, fire. This guy's a cruncher. He survives yeah, yeah. anything. He's an absolute animal. Nobody is scoring a goal because he's holding it down at That's center back. That's a very good center he's back. He's holding it down center back. at center back. That's a very good center back. Now, my midfield partnership, right? So, initially, I wanted to put Jake in goal, but I meant, like, Finn. Yeah. But um, you also crossed fucking... Um, Kick Patowski off, off my list and Ben 10. But in my midfield duo, the one that's uh, similar to Lilo and Stitch. Yeah. Perry the Platypus. Yes, I like that. I like that. I like that. Dynamic. He, he plays, I'd say he's like. Covers. I, a moderate. Kante role. A moderate. Kante. No, I, Kante. he's not running Marvel up and down like course. that. Lilo. No, Li- Stitch. Yours Stitch is, is Kante. Yours is Kante. Yeah. But mine is. Yeah, moderate. 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 Mo- moderate. Mm. Because he's not a KDB. He's not there yet. He, he has the vision. He can strike it though. Oh, can he, bro? Give me, give Rodri, me Rodri. I'll give oh, you a Rodri. No, 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 but that's too... Yeah, because he's, he's not physical Locked. like that either. That's right. Yeah. yeah, I'll give you a cross. Because Modric's better. But Perry the Platypus is a badass. Perry the Platypus is a... He's a fucking badass. He is a cross. Oh, for sure. I'm he partnering him in midfield. Yeah. 
the ultimate number eight, the mm -hmm. ultimate workhorse, the yeah. heart of the, the, the heartbeat of the team. Yeah. Super Mario. I like it, bro. That Italian flair. Uh, uh. Mm. He's like Only that, thing bro. is he does dive into challenges. Yeah, but you know you, you, you know that's true. He does. Yeah, but Luigi's yeah, but the calmer like of the two. Luigi's the calmer of the two. You want people to be scared, bro. That's true. You want that to be your captain. Roy, want... Roy Keane type. Ooh, I don't know if he's my captain, though. Oh. He's just the enforcer. All right, well, who's your captain? Number Loki, I'll accept it. Nah. Up top, who's your captain? Number one also has a, my striker, bro. Insane, bro. Who is it? Captain's mentality as well. Axel Blaze from Inazuma 11. Let me see. Oh, my days. This guy is just the shit. He's just the shit. He's wearing... He's yeah, yeah, fair. No, he is just the shit. Like, he's the he, star... He's wearing a Real Madrid here. kit? Oh, no. He's wearing okay. the Ray Raymond kit. Okay, fire, fire. But, bro, he's like a fire, like themed character you know all of his shots are like fire moves yeah like fire. he is the ultimate striker like he's the best striker of the show yeah he's that guy and it's a football show where they have special i'm telling you football he's a better striker than whatever this man blah, blah, but is blah. he the best football player in the world no but the goalkeeper is just like a god like i was okay. it's illegal otherwise i would have put that goalkeeper but in goal like it's illegal to add him he's the second best player in the world yeah basically okay then i think that him and leonardo will have a nice head-to-head <laughs> -head matchup bro no no he's he's dicking He's you just need to see his. He's only moves. ever played against people. Watch his special moves. Genuinely watch an Axel Blaze special move. Okay, let's let's do a top five. Let's do a top five, right? You have to guess which top five countries have the most nuclear weapons in the world. Ooh, I like it. So these five like countries it, like it, like it. that have the most in the world. America, number two. Babushka, babushka. Number one. So that's the two big giants out the way. The twin towers, you could say, out the way. Then we shall add Germany. Mm -mm. No. no, 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 not even the top. China, three, my friend. Number three. Now these last two, I think you know, might be a little bit more difficult. No, you got the three main ones. No, no, no. But I'm thinking because I saw I saw a list talking about it the other day. Like genuinely. Like, U.S. has an insane amount, bro. Russia U has 6,000. U.S. has an insane amount. U.S. has 5,500. And China has 350. Yeah. yeah. So the yeah. drop-off, like Russia yeah. and the U.S. Yeah. They are, like... They're also the only ones that have... For, it says that they have 1,400 actively deployed. I don't know what that means, but that means that, like, at any time, I feel like they can set off 1,400 oh. if they need to. I feel like that's what actively but deployed. The, but that's just, like, exploding our planets, bro. Yeah, for sure. Like, as soon as one nuke is sent, the planet is done, because yeah. then it'll all be sent. You know what I mean? Like... Like, it's not like anymore where you can send a nuke and they can't respond with a nuke. Imagine imagine if that's all media, right? And they all do that just to keep us in fear. Imagine. Imagine. Conspiracy. Yeah. It's crazy. Imagine. Crazy. Well, you're, you can't dodge it, though. You still have to guess number four and five. Oh, yeah. Um, England. The United Kingdom. Number United five. Kingdom, yeah. 225 total. 225. You're still missing number four. Yeah, bro. I, I'm, I, it's Eastern European, right? <laughs> Hungary. Nope. No, not Hungary. Belarus. Nope. Ukraine. Nope. Uh, Definitely well, not I Ukraine. Don't know why the fuck I said Ukraine, bro. Netherlands. <laughs> Nicholas, bro. I don't know. We don't have a single fucking nuke, bro. We don't have a single. No, nuke. no way. We have Pathetic, a nuke, bro. bro. Well, we're protected by America's nukes. But what? I can't get it, bro. Bro, I'm you will get it, bro. Think of like a retard, think bro. of you're thinking of Eastern Europe, bro. Think of a big country, bro. Huh? Uh, big country, Eastern Europe. No, not Eastern Europe. Stop thinking of Eastern Europe. Bro, you said you're you're thinking Eastern Europe. Yeah, think of a big country. Yeah, okay, I'm saying, well, I'm gonna think of a big Eastern I'm European saying, country. I'm saying don't think of Eastern Europe. Think of a big country. Bro. I don't know why you're thinking of Eastern Europe, bro. Fucker, bro. Brazil, bro. Fuckers, no, bro. I don't know, bro. It's in Europe, bro. And it's not in the east. <laughs> it's in the west, bro. Am I just being really stupid right now? Yes, bro. Well, not really super, but like you can, you can, like, you can easily, yes, bro. Okay, you can easily get this, bro. I don't know why you thought Eastern Europe. It, bro, I don't know. You bro, were rifling like, through them, bro. But then obviously somehow, like, bro, you know, you know, there's like I think it's Belarus. They mm. they like they like have some fucking like crazy friendship with with Russia, bro. They definitely yeah, borrowed some nukes fair. from Russia. That's bro. Fair. All right. Well, how let many me, nukes does France have? Like France what? has two hundred ninety. Oh, bro, ah, fuck the French. Bro. All right. Well, let me give you. Yeah, for real. 
Let me give you something else so you can redeem yourself, right? Because these ones you like, and I feel like you are good at these, right? No, so no. we're going to do, I'm going to give you five hints, right? And each hint, you can guess the country that it is. And if you get it wrong, and the head next day comes, if you get correct, you get correct. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? <laughs> you know what, I'm what have you just so, told me, bro? Basically, <laughs> repeat, let me, repeat, repeat. I'm going to give you a hint at a time, right? And after the hint, you have to, okay, let me restart. You have to guess what country Whoa, I'm thinking bro, of, bro. and I'm going to give you a hint every single time, right? I'm going to give you five hints. After every hint, you can guess, and the hints oh, will get that easier. Game. That game, yes, the TikTok game. So, right. The name, the name of this country's capital translates to Red Hero. Red Hero. Yeah. Just take a guess. Just fly out a guess. Turkey. Wrong. <laughs> oh. Second hint. This country's capital is the coldest in the world, averaging minus 1.3 degrees Celsius over the year. Finland. Wrong. I don't, I don't like, it, it, it doesn't make sense of a guess after that hint. Around a quarter of this country's population is nomads. You know what a nomad is? It's like, they don't have a, they don't have a home, they just like move around, you know what I mean? Bro. Do you want to recap on all the hints? Yeah, but I don't think it would help me. I remember them, but it doesn't help me, bro. Maybe this will help. Um, fuck, bro. Just throw Iceland. All right. Bro, I don't even know, bro. This country, now, now the hints got to be easier. This country is the origin of the second largest empire in history what this this country was the second largest empire in history like they're the origin of the second largest empire in history oh damn i'm gonna sound like a retard I'm not, ne like not a necessarily retard. and largest in terms of land area like this country's empire historically had the second most amount of land fuck bro i don't know um, yeah, but now it narrows it down, though. You know what I mean? Russia. No. <laughs> Fuck this, bro. All right, last, la, la, last one. Genghis Khan is considered this country's founding father. Oh fuck! Don't get me with the King is Khan, bro. Surely you know where Genghis don't Khan is from, Nicholas. Khan. Nicholas, you you don't have to know. The, no, don't, don't, don't. No, don't, but don't, you don't, have don't, to no, know. But, no, but no, how do you I not know? know? How do you not know? I know he was a fucking like. I how do you not know, bro? Like. Like it's the origin. Like he was a fucking crazy motherfucker, bro. It's the origin. I'll give you. You you want one more hint? <laughs> I'll give you a personalized Rango hint. It's something that you call me at least once a month. Yeah, India, Baki. No, a Mongol, bro. Oh. He's Mongolian, bro. Oh, oh yeah, oh yes. Monkey, bro. Oh, bro, listen, bro. Nigga. Genghis Khan. Nigga. Don't even don't even try me with bro, Genghis Khan. Bro, how you have to? Don't, Genghis don't, Khan, bro. low key better than Hitler, don't, bro. In that sense, in the terms of like what he's done, bro. Yeah, like, I know. You have to be, I've, yeah, at I've his time, yeah, in I his know, prime. I know, I know. His ratio was a lot better. The than land he covered and the things he did, he was ferocious, bro. But Women Hitler and children. Hitler didn't do it. He was on the front lines. Genghis was on the front lines, and he didn't need all those opioids that Hitler had, bro. Trust, bro. Hitler was all his advisors. Genghis Khan's ideas came free-flowing, bro. I'm telling you, everybody, if you want to be successful, you need a little bit of Genghis Khan in you, bro. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I'm wrong. I would bro. never guess that. A little bit of Genghis. All right. You could have had me going for fucking centuries. Do you want another one, or are you, you tapping out? I didn't know Mongolia was that cold. Yeah, me neither. Me neither. Oh, that was very crazy. You want another one, one or no? threw me off heavy, bro. Yeah, that's fair. That one would throw me off a lot. Um... Go for it. Yeah, go for uh, If it's so, not a fucking crazy one. No, no. This one, this one, this was much easier. Uh, this country once had five presidents in 10 days. Belgium. No. This country has the highest and lowest point in the Southern Hemisphere. And don't ask me what that means, because I don't know. Brother. The highest, like altitude in, in that sense, or just like... The highest and lowest point in the Southern Hemisphere. Okay. 
I would assume altitude. No. Should be melt. Because I'll Fuck tell you. It. I'm going to just go Argentina. Whoa! Out of correct. nowhere. Bang, 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 bang. Crazy. Yeah. Yes, correct. So you know what the Southern Hemisphere is? So uh, we've, redeemed, we've redeemed the Mongolia, I guess, bro. Yeah, so we've re- Southern Hemisphere. Yeah, that's that, yeah, that's South. Think of the globe. Yeah. Southern Hemisphere. Yeah, I get right. that. I understand. <laughs> I didn't say I, I no, I didn't say I didn't know what it was, but it's like mm, you asked wrong, me no. you asked me if it was altitude, bro. Altitude, I mean you're thinking like high mountain, low in the ocean, bro. Southern hemisphere, bro. Come on now. <laughs> don't try to pin bro, it on bro, me you just because you don't know. Hemisphere. Just because you don't know where Genghis Khan is from, bro. Come on now. Let's not let's not try this right. Now, let me give you one more. One last one. Right. Yeah, no, I know, I know. The, the gang is kind of, I, I'm sorry, like, genuinely, I deserve to you, I I, Like, I feel like you would look up to him, bro. I'm wearing a China shirt. Yeah, fair. So you probably wouldn't. The largest city is named after the first president in this country. The largest city is named after the first president. Um, fucking South Africa. No, not a bad guess though. This country will be the next to hit. That was Nigeria. This country will be the next to hit a hundred million people. Nigeria. No. This country invaded Cambodia. Who invaded Cambodia, bro? Think Did about you know this? From no from from here from here, I wouldn't get it yet. The next one, I'd get it. All I know is that it was like a war-like territory, bro. You think about the countries that are nearby, but also I don't really, you know, it's not my uh, strong suit. Yeah, it's really not my strong suit either. I don't really have a strong suit when it comes to that, bro. I can't lie. Bro, Cambodia, bro. Just 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 pick a pick a country. What continent is Cambodia in? Fucking Asia, bro. There we go. And I guess you know a nice little country in there. I swear Cambodia touches um, hmm? Pakistan. Pakistan. Fuck it, Pakistan. Does no. It touch Pakistan. You know what? Like, we can find out in a second. But this one, you will get it on. The last American draft was for a war in this country. Vietnam. Yes, correct. Now let's see if Cambodia touches Pakistan. Does it? Because I don't I, like I couldn't even tell you 100 percent where Vietnam is either, bro. But they, it's all in the same area, no? Cambodia so does not Cambodia? touch Pakistan. Can it touches. It's far away. It touches Thailand, Laos, and Vietnam. It is Can far. I see away. It on the world map. Yeah, let's go world map. Oh. Bro, why, I don't know why you're looking for images, bro. Just go Google Maps. Nah, nah, nah. we're on Google Earth. Oh, Google Earth is crazy. Google Maps is fucked, bro. Let's go Google no Earth. No way you use Google Earth, bro. That's crazy. Bro, when you're scuffed, come on now. I mean, fair enough, but like, I'm never a Google Earth user. All right, so Cambodia is here, which is very close to Indonesia, and Pakistan is all the way over here. Oh. Oh, damn. They're, they're nowhere near each other. Wow. Wow. Yeah. But that's a moment for both of us. But, bro, I didn't know where in Asia, like, Cambodia yeah. was, bro. Yeah. They were invaded by Vietnam. It doesn't. Gunk of Vietnamese, man. All I knew, like, I knew that there was, like, bomb sites and, like, you can, like, like, it's just, like, a heavily, like... Mm. Yeah, that was a... Bomb-infested area. Bro, we're 53 minutes in. I'm gonna whip out the munchie, right? Oh, fine. And, like, when you had, like, the top three, like, uh, do you want this? No. When we came with the um, start bench cell, we mentioned the... Like three elite munchies, right? But I don't have no creative creativity anymore, bro. Like genuinely, like like I don't get ideas for munchies anymore. So yeah. I went online and I searched what's the best stoner munchie. Yeah, fire. And what a lot of places said was some bullshit American stuff, right? So it's just like, get the fuck out of mm-hmm. here. And a lot of them said nachos and dip. Ooh, if you got nachos and dip, bro. Bro, so I got nachos and tell dip. me you got nachos and dip. Uh, I have three nachos. Oh, crazy, I have some crazy, sweet chili, crazy. Sweet chili oh, flavored brother. ones oh, and oh. some like cool, uh, oh. cool, cool cream. ranch. Cool like, cream, it says Cool here. cream. That's yeah. something for the Americans, bro. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, cream. Wow. And then some salsa dip. All right, well, let's move our box out the way because we don't want to ruin this. 
I don't want to get my sticky fingers. Are you capable of opening the salsa dip? Are you strong enough? Yeah. Yeah? But we have to move the box. Is it heavy? You don't have the mic. All right. Give me the salsa. Free bell day. There we go. All right, first try the, the sweet chili one and then the cool cream flavor one All separately. Right. We can cut out the shot. Uh, no, 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 just go quickly. Try them separately. With the dip like, first? Just, no, just try it, just try it. And then you need to clean the palate, of course, before you have this one. Mm. Okay, what are we saying? You, you don't I like that, I like that. Rate it. Mm. On a scale of one to ten, I give like a seven. Tastes a lot like sweet chili. That's cream. a very good tortilla chip. Yeah. I'll say that again in the mic. That's a very good tortilla chip. All right. Mm -hmm. Now I'm trying to cool cream. I think that this is gonna taste like like the Doritos Cool Ranch. That's what I'm expecting. You know what I mean? That's exactly what it tastes like. I feel like. Yeah. Right. These are also very good. But I feel like I could eat more of those than I could of these, you know what I mean? Just personally. Yeah. They don't have, they didn't have the Doritos. They only had one uh, style of Doritos. Oh. But which one's better with the salsa dip is the question. I feel like mm -hmm. this one would be. You prefer this one? You prefer sweet chili? Yeah, sure. Sure. I haven't tried it with the salsa though, because that with the salsa is fucking good though. I mean, it's all right. Mm. It's got a nice little, uh, it's got a nice little. Uh, Low-key, that one might be better, bro. I'm gonna take three in one go. Three is devious. Bro, I'm telling you, if you, bro, I so badly wanna go to Mexico. Yeah, fire. Why? Mm. Right, bro. Mm. Shout out to China. Shout out to Chile. Zach. Brazil. Shout out to Newcastle, I'm wearing their shorts. Day one fun. Huh? And Batman's signing for Newcastle. Imagine, 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 imagine. Imagine, imagine. So it's that time of the podcast. <laughs> no, but genuinely imagine. No, there's no way. Bro, Im bro, they have to free up space, but they don't have to free up a wage bill. They don't have to free up a yeah, wage bill. Mbappe does not want to go to Newcastle, bro. Says who, bro? If Newcastle free up space to make 300 million worth of signings and guarantee Mbappe Premier League football, Champions League football. Bro, if but he can get yeah, that. Getting Champions League football. He could get that at other Premier League teams. Mm? If he wants guaranteed yeah, Champions League football. Liverpool. But Liverpool, Liverpool are getting a new manager. But so are Newcastle, to be fair. I think they So should. he's going to go to Real Madrid. Which everyone knows. Mm-mm. Or he signs for another year, but he's low key crazy, crazy turn no, events. Imagine, bro, if imagine. If he does that, if he does that, he's just that's the ultimate fuck you to Real Madrid, bro. Bro, imagine. I back it. Mm, okay. I back it. Now they're on the topic of uh, Real Madrid and uh, football. Should we enlighten them on our on our recent findings about our trip? So, Go be my uh, a little background story. About two weeks ago, I think we said last week as well. We. Booked a trip to Barcelona on the from the 9th to the 11th of March to go watch them play against Mallorca. You know, because you're a Barcelona fan, but you also support Mallorca. So it's like, you know, that's a that's a great game to watch, right? And also, like, Vikings to Barcelona never hurts, you know what I mean? And, like, we haven't been on a vacation in a while. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. no, but since summer, it's like, we never really do, like, middle-of-the-year vacations. Yeah, yeah, that's fact. And, like, before, the, before uni gets serious again, you might as well. Like, so serious again. Is it not serious now? Yeah, but in the sense of like exam, well, like when you couldn't go on vacation, you know what I mean? Like, it's not you don't have to do stuff now, but like, you know. I mean? No, no, no. But yeah, so we booked from the 9th to the 11th, but we didn't know what day the game was going to be on. Can you tell them a little bit about that? Because you're, because you, 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 you understand that more. See, on the website, when we were buying the tickets, it said the match is either on the 9th or the 10th, which was a Saturday or a Sunday. At no. <laughs> I'm over with it. I'm over with it. So we bought the. So I just I clocked that you switched off the mic. Yeah. Um. We bought the tickets, assuming that the game would be on either the ninth or the tenth. 
See, then we bought the flight tickets, planning to arrive on the 9th during the day, quite close to the Exactly, but we were okay with... At 9 o'clock. Like, if we land at 7 and the game's at 9, quickly rush there, maybe miss 10 minutes, miss... That's okay, you know what I mean? So we plan to arrive from the 9th to the 11th. Now, all of a sudden... <laughs> Barcelona starts playing on a fucking Friday. Yeah. and the What world are we living in? So we were in the car and we check and Nico says, oh, you know, Barcelona, oh, they're going to play. And he checks the date and it's the 8th at 9 o'clock and we arrive on the 9th and we're like, why the fuck could this be? Why would they ever play on a Friday? And we check, it's because they have a Champions League game against Napoli on Tuesday, the 12th. So we are literally there. They have two games in one week. And we are, Saturday, like we are there in the time space. When neither game is there. So we're going to go watch a Kings League game. But there's no Kings League games either. There are. There are. Genuinely, they'll be more expensive than Barcelona games. Mm, I don't know, but I, I kind of want to go, bro. Like, if it's like... That'll be so fire, bro. If, I'll pay 30 euros to go. Yeah, for sure. 30. And if not, bro, genuinely, like, we can watch some youth football stuff, bro. Not pedophiles. We're not fucking pedophiles. I think we need to clarify that one. I don't agree with you. <laughs> you don't agree with me. All right, so moving on to my song of the week. All right. In song of the week, I have Flights by Bando Bop and Lil Baby. All right. So here we go. Oh, fire. It came from the speaker. Like, we can play it, and then like we'll just like cut five seconds, but then you can hear all of it. Because you got to hear the Lil Baby part as well. Wait for little baby to come in. Guess wait. It takes him a second to come in. Mm -hmm. yeah, I mean, yeah. I'm just saying. It's decent so far. Like it. Baby's such a good feature, bro. Yeah. Baby girl. Yeah. You still got it. Ah, and then, you know. Bando Bop comes back. Oh, Bando Bop. Yeah. So that's my song of the week. Add to the playlist. And also, this is the picture for the song. Tell me that's not a fire ass picture. You know what I mean? That's fire. Like, that's a dope ass girl picture. Like, you, like, you got a blunt, you got a passport, you got a little baby there. Oh, there's a blunt? Yeah, there's a blunt there. Can't make you want to keep. Exactly. And, the, and there's two AirPods. There's a broken phone. Come on now. That's, that's really how it got to be. Do -do -do. Are you done? Because I'm done. I mean, I have one more thing to talk about. I do actually have one more thing to talk about. All right. And this is a serious topic, right? Okay, this here is we a go. Issue that I need to here and I wanted go. to hear your opinion on it, right? So, NBA All-Star Weekend mm. happened, right? That's fact. I wanted to talk about it. The NBA All-Star Weekend happened, which means that there was a dunk contest, a three-point contest, a, a skills challenge, a celebrity game, right? A rising stars game, if not four, and then an all star game. And bloody, 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 bloody. And all these halftime things and all these things, all these different events, right? So much, so many interviews, right? I don't know if you've, ha like, how much have you seen of, like, have you seen Everything. the dunk? You've seen the dunk contest? Not the entire thing, but I've seen, like, clips of okay. everything. You've seen the three point contest. Like, you know that Steph beat yeah. Sabrina. Yeah. Genuinely, that was the only. Like, the three-point contest was the only good part about this. I don't like it, bro, because it was a lose-lose for Steph Curry anyways. Yeah, but I still, I still think it was good, though. Because, like, it wasn't, like, like, it was fire, in my opinion. Like, although it was a lose-lose for Steph, I don't think that he lost in this at all. Because no, no one's no, saying, no, 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 no. like, no one's hating on him, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, yeah. That, but generally, like, this three-point contest was one of the best in years, right? I'll say. Didn't she, she did pretty well, bro. Yeah, I she did. Lie. She tied 
She had 26, which Dame, who won the three-point contest, he got 26 in his final round. Obviously, yeah. she's using a smaller ball, but it's also like and you can't... Closer. No, no, she she was at the normal... Th- she yeah? Says, yeah, yeah, she said she was going to go yeah, to the normal... Yeah, she said she wanted exactly. to, but it wasn't going to, was it? Yeah, it was, of course. It was? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, she did, she did. However, like, people are saying, like, yeah, but she should use the actual ball. It's like, bro, you can't make... Like, making Steph shoot with a smaller ball is also fucked up because he's used to the bigger ball. You know what I mean? Like, someone, why do they play with a smaller ball? Because their hands are smaller. So, bro, basketball, like, basketball. Yeah, but you adapt the rules, like, bro, like... The footballs that, that you play with, like... Of course, of course. But, bro, like... You understand, like, if... if the sports, if, the sports. Yeah, but of course, but if the ball is smaller, it's easier to handle, and then you're better. Like, for entertainment-wise, like, you have to realize, like, it, it is still a business. Like, it makes sense for them. Like... Grow bigger hands. No, but, yeah. But, like, still, I think it's a win-win. But everything else in the All-Star weekend was fucking shit. Like, terrible. Terrible. Because even... The game... The, 220 points scored or 211 points yeah, scored. Yeah, it's, it, it's the first also game that cracked 200. Which is like... I like it, bro. Bro, but it's it's a sh- it's not good, bro. It's not good. I don't like, mind the All-Star game itself. Bro, but like, you don't like... stuff, I don't understand. Bro, the All-Star game, like you've never seen a good All-Star game, bro. All no, the, not competitive. All these, all these All-Star games are shit, bro. They're all bad, bro. They're, a couple years ago, there were a couple competitive ones which were actually good at the end. 220, yeah, 185. shots like with freedom. Yeah, of course, but bro, like two twenty, like one fifty five, like that's shit, bro. Like that's not what you want, bro. Like you want to see it close at the end, bro. I'm saying, yeah, yeah, if you like, if you can get it to be competitive, fair play. But bro, they're there for laughs, bro. Of they, course, they have to play another seventy nine games. But I'm saying, bro, like jogging around, bro. The one thing that has to be done because Adam Silver needs to change something, and he's been trying for years, right? Like they've been trying to make this stuff better. But when players like Anthony Edwards, which I respect him for doing it, start fucking like shooting with their left and hitting the side of the backboard, right? That's not a good look for Adam Sandler. I think it's a good look for the NBA because it brings attention to it. But yeah, for Adam well, Sandler, or not Adam Sandler, Adam Silver, my bad. For Adam Silver, it's not a good look. Adam Sandler? Yeah. Adam I, Sandler is a bowler, though, apparently. He is a bowler. But for Adam Silver, it's not a good look. You know what I mean? Yeah. What needs to be done, in my opinion, right? So Flight reacts clowning Anthony Edwards as well. He was like, bro, yeah, he has so a- shit. I'm signing up for the NBA. I'm signing up for the yeah, NBA. Bro, bro. I'm going to sign up for the three point contest, right? Yeah, and then the chat keeps saying, like, fucking, he's shooting with his left hand. He's ignoring it. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chat said left hand. Oh. <laughs> Fuck, bro. I haven't been on my flight, bro. And he still said he should do it, bro. Yeah. yeah but, he's but. not hitting a single three, bro. Under that pressure, no chance, bro. I love flight, bro. Because the thing bro. is, it's not just making all those threes. You got to do that in quick succession. Yeah, that's true. But it's also, but Loki, like, once you get in a rhythm, it is, but, bro, like, you do get tired by the end, bro. Like, if you shoot that me threes in a row, bro, like, you get tired, bro. Bro, when I saw Adebayo throw the ball at Jokic, did you see it? Mm-hmm. Like, they scored a bucket, right? Mm-hmm. So, Adebayo goes behind the line and then throws it off of Jokic's Oh, off, off Jokic's back, yeah, yeah. yeah fine. 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 But I was like, oh, damn, like, these two, like, these two had, like, beef. Yeah, I said, there was a little bit of beef in one of the Rising Stars games. One of the... I yep. forget who it was, but somebody said another, like, two rookies, one of them told the other one, like, even in the Rising Stars game, you can't guard me. Mm. And I was like, I mean, what are you doing? But I think what needs to be added, right, if you were to ask me what should be added, add a 1v1 competition. Add a 2v2. Yeah, that's the best thing. That's 1v1 what people want to see. is the best thing. And it's for high classes. Five dribbles, or, like, just, like, quick things, like, give it to them. At the post, right? Like, the way that... I don't know if you've ever seen, like, the Team USA, like, practice video. Mm-hmm. But they just... Like, they play 1v1. You get the ball at, like, the free throw line. And, like, you just do, like, one oxy. And, like... Yeah, They just yeah. do no, crazy no, no, favors, no. like, bro. And the, and it all goes in. Like, that's what people want to see, bro. Like, that's... Make the All-Stars... That's the best content. Make bro. the All-Stars 1v1, I wanna bro. I want to see players 1v1, like, bro. Like, exactly, bro. Like, that's what you got to do. Yeah, crazy content. And it's not like they're going to try hella hard. You know what I mean? Like, it's not like they're going to play super intense. Because no one's trying to get injured, but still, like, bro, that's what we want to see. That's you know like, bro, mean? yeah. But I did see the horse, bro. No, not horse. Um, fuck it, what's it called when you have, like, two players shooting in the ball? Like, if if the second player shoots it and gets it in before the first person, yeah, yeah. he's out. I don't, know what the, I don't know what the name Ladder? is, but, like, yeah. But we played it, We played, but, like, we, but like, I don't know how we They were playing that at the All-Star, like, warm-up. Yeah, it's fine. Because Jokic and Doncic went, went first, like, two times. Fucking fire content. Like that's the stuff I mm. like. Bro. I like seeing them like mess about, you know, because there, they, there is just pure vibes. Like NBA normal like season is already just vibes. That's just pure vibes. But sometimes that's the best form of like basketball. 
Facts. Wow. Well, well, well you're beautiful. High as fuck. What a beautiful episode, bro. Well, oh, shout out to the strain, Bubba Kush. <laughs> Bubba Kush. <laughs> no, we never even said the strain. That's good to know. That's good to know. Yeah, shout out to shout out to, shout out to open your mind. Yeah, for real. Thank you guys so much. Make sure to check out the Instagram. The link will be in the description. We got some stuff up here, and like you guys will be seeing this box more often, bro, because it's fire, bro. It looks so good, bro. It'll be a permanent. And this is and, and this is a new product. Season two. It's a new product, so go you know give it a look. And this isn't nothing sponsored. They can send it to us for free, and it's like it's really nice. So like you know we gotta shut them out, bro. So thank you guys so much. Bye bye. Love you, Jimmy.